So this is Craig Stern. I'm just going to give you a quick, um, quick sort of demonstration on how you can create seamlessly looping musical tracks. So first things first, you will notice I am using a program called Audacity. Audacity is freely downloadable from the internet. It costs you zero dollars. Super easy. You just go to audacity.sound or sorry, .sourceforge.net, and you can nab it for Windows, Mac, and Linux absolutely free. It's a super great program. Given that it's free, um, I'm a fan. So first thing you need to do when you want to loop a track is you're going to just zoom right in and find the very start of where the sound begins for your track. and are going to zoom out and select everything that happens before that moment and just hit delete on your keyboard. You're just gonna delete it so that the track starts immediately when we hit play. Now <clears throat> I'm using the uh, the tavern theme here from uh, from Telepath Tactics. Let's say we want it to loop kind of near the end here. Like, let's say right there we want it to loop. So here's what we do. We get everything after that point. We just, you know, hold down shift and click at the end. Control X to cut it. And then we're going to go back to the beginning of the track. And we are going to do the following. Go to tracks, add new stereo track. This will create a second track for us to work with. Uh, it's just like a layer in a, you know, uh, a visual editing program. Then we're just going to do Control-V. Boom! Easy as that. Next, what we're going to do, you might notice that the play button has changed there. It looks like it's kind of a, a looping symbol. If you hold down Shift when you press play, it will loop the track. So we can actually test this out and see how it sounds. And there you have it, the seamless loop.